what is going on my wonderful people of YouTube it is Thursday and uh, I am off today so it's kind of nice it's my first time having a day off during the weekend probably about a month uh, the only reason I'm off is just because uh, we work one Saturday a month at my office which is pretty nice because I'll be off on the weekends <clears throat> but uh, we kind of take turns working Saturdays so this Saturday I have to work which is fine I don't really care we don't work that all that much like probably like half a day but I'm gonna be working and um, yeah so I got the day off we got to get a day off during the week so I just so happen to get Thursday which works out pretty nicely because I am gonna be meeting up with somebody a little bit later I'll fill you guys in what's gonna be going on I'm pretty excited um, Hey, what are you doing? Hey. Hi. Bye. Hi. Say hi, YouTube. Okay. Bye. No. No? You want to hang out? You want to stay hang out with your uncle? <clears throat> Sorry about that, guys. There was knocking at my door, and it turned out ended up being my niece. So you saw that. She's weighing in. You know, I got her on a macros plan, too. I have her on a daily regimen. She's working out. No, I'm totally bullshitting, guys. Anyways, I uh, totally forgot what I was saying. I lost track of what I was saying, but I think I was just talking about <clears throat> uh, why I'm off today. Anyways, I think she's knocking again. Hold on. Let's see. Yep, she just ran away. Alright, sorry about that. Again, so today's going to be a pretty interesting day. Um, something happened over the weekend, well, over last weekend, like last Saturday. Um, I was talking to somebody on Instagram about something. I'll fill you guys in a little bit later about what's going on. I don't really want to say it just yet, just because I don't want to jinx it. But... I will get footage later and let you guys know what's going on right now. I'm just preparing for the day, so I kind of look like shit. My hair's all fucked up, but it's all good. I'm going to get ready, and I will check in with you guys in a little bit, okay? Right, so I'm all done and ready to go. Man, you have no idea how hard it is to style curly hair. It is a fucking pain in the ass. I don't know if any of you out there have curly hair, but, man, it's a struggle. Like, I use so much pomade and so much hair product just to keep my curls down. And man, it sucks. Anyways, ready to, I'm all ready for the day. I'm gonna go run a few errands. Gotta make a few stops. Um, gotta go to Lowe's, get some stuff. But I will take you guys along the journey. So, peace. Just finished up at Lowe's. I ended up picking up, uh, I'm trying to kind of brighten up my room a little bit. So, I ended up buying a, just like a little glass, uh, honest, you call it. It's like one of those new little glass bowl things for uh for the ceiling fan and I, I bought some brighter bulbs just because i don't really like the way the lighting is in my room so it's it's kind of dark and then me i wear glasses so every time i'm in there with my glasses on it's just i'm just blinded so i figured i'd need to get a, a few things kind of fix the lighting in there especially when i'm trying to take those selfies or those progress pictures i could never get good lighting in there so bought that and then next up i'm gonna go to walmart Walmart's the one store that I just hate, hate, hate going to. Like, I love their prices. I love their deals. It's awesome. But it's just one of the stores that I'm always lazy to go to just because of how packed it always is. And it's just, I don't like it. But I'll be there in a little bit. So What is going on, guys? Just got home. Just finished eating meal number two. I am so full right now. I'm about to unload all the stuff that I bought. Well, not unload, but just take them out of the bags. So let me show you guys what I got. I just went to Walmart and to Lowe's. This is what I got at Lowe's. This, this is the thing I was talking about. I don't know what it's called. But, um, <clears throat> that, the flush mount ceiling fixture. So, basically, what I want to do is switch that thing out just because I feel like the lighting isn't really that good. And then I got, uh, just some different light bulbs. I want to <clears throat> try them out. Maybe they give out a little bit more light. So, that's what I got at Lowe's. And then I got some stuff at Walmart. <clears throat> Just the daily essentials. I got some boxers, cause you know your boy has to keep it fresh. 
I got some hangers just because I've been getting a lot of new shirts and personally I'm a type of person who I don't like to fold my shirts I like to hang them just so I can keep them clean especially the ones with like big logos and all that I like them to not wrinkle up and all that so got some handy dandy <clears throat> hangers this shirt was on sale I don't usually ever buy clothes from Walmart I mean sometimes I buy like uh, like I said like personal items just like undershirts or like boxers socks stuff like that but I figured out eh, it was on sale it was uh, five bucks it's a Spongebob shirt I thought it was actually pretty funny here let me lay it out for you guys give me a second so I got this shirt it was f literally five bucks it's pretty funny it's Spongebob and Patrick on a cat I love Spongebob that's what I grew up watching so I figured eh, I might as well get it <clears throat> and then what else did I buy Oh, I bought a brush. I was telling you guys earlier, man. It's a hassle for me to comb my hair and just like to get it straight. And I have many different combs, and and I have one brush, but I've never gotten one of these types of brushes. So I figured it was time to get one just to see if it can help me, because I'm really trying to grow out my hair right now, kind of just keep the sides shorter than grow out the top. So I'm gonna see how well this works. Um, let's see what else did I buy? It with that oh i did buy some since uh, valentine's day is coming up and you know your boy's single as fuck i bought some some chocolates some boxes of hard chocolates so people can think that i have a valentine but i don't have a valentine so yeah but anyways guys i'm gonna put all this stuff away um, i'm gonna try and change out that glass bowl for my ceiling fan light and then do a couple more things and then later on I'm going to get ready for the gym and I'm going to meet up with that guy I was talking to you guys earlier and I'll let you know what's going on with that. So I just took the little bowl out. That's the bulb it has on there right now. Let me show you guys the lighting with this one so you guys can kind of get a glimpse of, of what it looks like right now before I switch it out. So let me switch it out and I'll show you guys what That's it looks like. That's a new bulb I just put on. So let me turn on and see how this plays out. Oh yeah. So there you go, that's a difference so far right there on the lighting. And then right here, <clears throat> this is a old bowl. And this is a new one I got, it's just clear. But I mainly just got it because I wanted it to light up a little bit better. So I'm going to put that on and then see how it turns out. Let there be light. I'm all done. That was actually a pretty easy swap. Personally, I think the lighting actually looks a lot better. I don't know, you guys are going to be able to tell me a little bit later once you see the comparison when I post this up. So just let me know in the comments which light looks better because personally to me, I think this one's a lot brighter, looks a little bit better. But then again, I don't know. So I'll check it out later when I go to edit the video. Alright guys, so I'm on my way to the gym right now. I was talking to you guys a little bit earlier. I was kind of being secretive and all that. So I'm, I'm going to tell you basically uh, what's been going on. A, lot, a lot's been happening since uh, the last video uh, I posted. Um, a few things have happened. A few doors have opened up. Like, um, I don't know if I've mentioned this before. Or if any of you guys that follow me on uh, Instagram or anything like that know this. Um, I'm a rep for Bear Fitness. And I'm also a rep for uh, Alpha Beast Army. Or Alpha Beast Apparel, whatever you want to say. I'm gonna put the links down below for my discount code um, and yeah so that's that's pretty exciting news you know it's awesome being a rep for a company you know it's a great way to to start out it's a great way to get out there like just for whatever it is you're trying to do me personally uh, I really like this YouTube thing I like making videos and I'm really trying to get out there as much as I can so I think it's a great way for me to do that and then something else happened uh, <laughs> last weekend this, this is a few weeks after i became well i've been a rep for alpha beast for a while now it's just most of their clothing and stuff like that is pre-ordered you know because the, the guy who's who started the company you know he's just starting now he's trying to get things uh, set in the stone so props to him and then bear fitness i've been probably rep, a rep for them for probably like maybe two weeks now or whatever the case is anyways last weekend uh last saturday i went to disneyland and it's kind of funny i was talking to my coworker about how like a lot of uh sponsored athletes and all that like it must be nice you know the ones that are sponsored by uh meal prep companies you know because they save money they save time you know being able to just have their meals prepped for them already you know it makes it easier for you to to cut weight and just hit your goals you know anyways uh this guy uh messaged me on uh, instagram his name's wensy and that's actually where i'm going right now i'm going to meet up with him to get a workout in and then he's gonna 
basically uh, give me some prepped meals. Basically, uh, long story short, he pretty much asked me what I thought about becoming a sponsored athlete for him or just being sponsored by him. You know, he can give me prep meals and all that. And, you know, I was ecstatic when he told me that. I just had no idea how to react. You know, I didn't know if it was real or, you know, if it was just like a scam or anything like that, you know. Because with, with internet nowadays, especially with social media, you know, there's a lot of people trying to get stuff out there like i know i've seen a couple companies where they're like oh hey join us be a part of our team but you have to pay like a certain amount of money and you're pretty much uh your own rep and like sometimes it's like just scams like that but anyways this man's guy talked for a little bit and yeah he just told me you know like uh that he was inspired by me that his brother i was one of the first people his his other brother had mentioned to like becoming an ambassador or a sponsor or whatever you want to call it and then he just asked me about it, and I said, you know, hell yeah, like, of course, like, that, that's, that's fucking awesome, and that's basically what's been going on, you know, just a few things that, uh, I haven't really mentioned, or why I probably haven't posted anything, you know, I've just kind of been, I've just kind of been trying to figure things out and see what's going on, so I'm gonna go meet up with him right now, I'm gonna pick up my first set of meals, and we're gonna get a workout in, we're gonna hit chest and tries, um, and yeah, I'm just really excited, you know, like, it may not seem like a really big deal, you know, obviously, starting off small, but to me, like, that's a huge deal. Like, I never in a million years would ever thought that anybody was going to want to sponsor me or be like, hey, you know, like, how would you like to be a rep for this company? You know, like, to me, that's a big deal. That's, that's badass, you know. <laughs> me, I just love lifting. You know, I love being in the gym. I love working out. You know, I love seeing the progress and how far I've gone from when I first started. And that's honestly what keeps me going. That's what keeps me motivated, you know. And, you know, not, not everybody wants to make it in the fitness industry i know like there's a lot of people who say you know you know it's hard to make it there's so much competition you know for me it's if something comes out of it that's awesome if nothing comes out of it i don't really care you know because i'm still getting healthier and, and i'm bettering myself day by day so to me that's the most rewarding part and to get a little extra bonus like this you know companies hitting me up or or uh, this guy wednesday hitting me up you know to to you know pretty much advertise this company and be a part of it like you know that that's amazing to me like that's awesome and, and that that stuff like that is what keeps me going you know that's it's gonna make me better myself and i'm gonna push myself harder because it's like now i have you know a company under my belt that i really need to promote you know and really need to like show like you know like this is this is what we're all about you know what i mean so that's just some quick news i wanted to share with you guys i'm gonna I'm heading to the gym right now, so I don't want to keep vlogging because I don't want to crash. But hopefully I can try and get some footage in there. But either way, I'll keep you guys updated on what happens. This is the first time I'm meeting him. Seems like a really cool guy. He's local to my area, which is awesome. Makes things easier. And yeah, I'll let you guys know how that goes. What is going on, guys? Just finished hitting this chest and try workout. Met up with my boy, Wainsey. He's super cool dude, super laid back. He's really driven and motivated. Man, I'm honestly... I'm really glad he hit me up, and I'm really glad we're gonna be working together. I think it's gonna be a really big step into, you know, greatening the future, you know, making it better, hitting goals, you know, staying motivated. He's probably one of the, the most motivated people that I've met in a while. Like, aside from going to the LA Fit Expo, man, this cat, he's just a super cool dude, you know. Super blessed that he's uh, giving me the opportunity to, to represent his company, be a sponsor athlete i mean i'm not necessarily an athlete i'm not there yet but um i'm super stoked he gave me my first set of meals um kind of take a look right there so super hyped super excited to try them out we'll see how everything else goes i'm gonna put the link in the description box so you guys can go and follow uh, his instagram account hit him up with any inquiries any questions you know meals look pretty bomb so far i haven't tried them yet so i won't be able to tell you that yet but i'm sure they taste really good but all in all i think today's been a great day i think things are looking pretty bright for the future and i'm really excited to see where 2016 takes me and just where 2016 is gonna you know where, where it's gonna go you know what's gonna happen in the next few months you know i've never been more motivated in my life you know than i am now and i think that's really gonna help out in accomplishing my goals and just uh getting where I want to be so super excited to be on his team super excited to get things going again all the information you guys are going to need is going to be in the description I'm going to tag it below I'm going to tag bear fitness as well I'm going to put my discount code you guys can use for them my discount code for uh, alpha beast apparel and 
yeah, if you guys have any questions, if you guys have any uh, anything you want me to talk about, anything you guys want to see in the future, I'm sure you guys maybe are probably going to want to see some full day of eating videos, which is going to be a lot easier now that I'm having prepped meals. Um, other than that, I'll let you guys know how everything else you know, plays out. I'll let you know how the meals taste. Have a blessed day. Stay swell, my friends. Peace.